Hey, Chris Arbiton here in downtown Largo at our actual physical store. And we're here to answer some of the most frequently asked questions that we ever hear. And to help me is Marianne. You know, I've always wondered, what is the largest U.S. note? That's a great question. We hear that one all the time. If you had to guess, what do you think it would be? Mm, my guess would be about 10000 It's a great guess. Actually, the $10,000 bill was the biggest one that the people were allowed to use. And 5000 they made. They also made a, a 1000 and a 500 But the largest size they made was a $100,000 bill, but it was only for bank transfers. Mm, okay. Who was on that note? Oh, okay. I'll, that, I have to get my cheat sheet here. But on that note uh, was Woodrow Wilson was on the 100000 And on the 10000 Sam and P. Chase, the 5000 James Madison, Grover Cleveland would be on the 1000 and William McKinley would be on the 500 And here is a great shot of what those notes actually look like. Do you know when they stopped making it? Yeah, they stopped making most of those notes in 1934 because basically after that they just wanted to stay with smaller denominations. Today, if, you, if the bank gets a 500 and above note, it's actually legally bound to turn that into the Federal Reserve, but that's not good for the customers. Is that because there's been a change in value? Well, yeah, actually it's because these notes are worth quite a bit more. I mean, the $100,000 bill is, I mean, practically priceless, but I don't, it, there's still some legalities to what if you had one, you could own it. If you had a $10,000 bill, it'd be anywhere from $40,000 to $100,000. Wow. Yeah, the $5,000, $3,500 to $90,000. I'd say the thousands are $1,200 to $2,500, and the $500, $700 to $1,500. Wow. Well, thank you. I appreciate that explanation. All right. Thank you very much, and thanks for joining us.